Good morning. Just starting again on the deck in here. Again, for being a composite guy, we got a wood deck, so that's great. Just setting up my camel fastener here. What I love about camel is they always provide you a driver bit, which works perfectly with the camel fastener. Remember my last video? I claimed this was 5 16 when it was actually 3 16 But we've actually had the homer request that we get it a little bit tighter because it was a little more barefoot friendly. So, out with that. We got ourselves a new toy. You should watch to the end when I unboxed this yesterday. Yeah, just watch to the end. Anyways, this claims for 1 16th. So this is the Marksman Pro Dash X1. What this does for us, look at that. It's barefoot approved, even better. Somebody's got to clean up after me because that's a real bad mess. Big difference here is now our spacers here are 1 16th instead of the 3 16 So just bring it a little bit smaller. So that is helpful when our wood is green, it's gonna shrink. So we'll probably end up with a 3 16 space, but we start with a smaller gap and that way when it shrinks, it's gonna work nicely. But you see here, we have the decking all tight right now, which is not gonna work at all because then the water's gonna pool here cause and rot. So let's just show you how to use it. Camel's a nice simple system. This is my first time using the Marksman Pro X1. So let's get to it. Normally I don't pre-cut my boards, but because of how the situation ties in here at the post and everything, I have to repeat. Pre-cut it all. That is super small. Look at that. It's barely anything there. Just reach around, grab my screw. Look at that, that easy. Now I just need to grab some more screws. Look at that, just gotta pull that tight. It's always a good idea to screw from the front side first because that just helps to make sure it straightens itself up. one way or the other. That is, that is damn tight. Nice little handy little latch there, just to trap it to your boards. These are five and a half. I think it also works up to, down to four and three quarters. Check on the other video too if you need to. I find with wood decking, as you're putting it together, your gap's going to have a little bit of variation and, and even the size of your board. So every like six or five or six boards, you want to have a little correction line just to make sure that everything's working out for the end. Or you don't have some kind of funny wonky board once you get to the house. But there she is, the Mark Camel Marksman Pro X1. Gives you a nice small gap. It's a little bit more bare fret friendly. And then when the wood shrinks, because it's green right now, a little bit wet, you still have a nice small gap here, giving you a nice little place to walk on. Enjoy your deck. There was a 5 16 gap when it was actually 3 16 Well, hopefully they requested that we might tighten this one up even a little bit more. So we got ourselves a new Camel 1 16 Marksman Pro X1. So, Thought I'd share that with you guys when I get my new toys. Voila! It looks the exact same thing.